Today, I'm going to show you how to block a website on Safari. Whether you're trying to boost productivity or keep certain sites away from your kids, I've got you covered. Let's start with Safari's settings on your iPhone. Open Settings. Go to Screen Time. And tap Content and Privacy Restrictions. Enable the button. Then tap App Store, Media, Web, and Games. Choose Web Content and select Limit Adult Websites. If you want to block a specific site, like a porn website, tap Add Website in the Never Allow section and enter the URL. Remember, once added, the URL can't be edited. To change or delete it, slide the URL to the left, tap Delete, and add a new one. Now, let's move to your Mac. Blocking websites here is pretty similar. I'll guide you through the steps. On your Mac, click the Apple logo at the top left corner, choose System Preferences, and select Screen Time. In the left menu, choose Content and Privacy, and then turn on the button. Under Web Content, select Limit Adult Websites, then tap Customize. In the Restricted option, tap the plus icon to add any website you want to block. Then click OK. If you're looking to keep your children away from certain websites on their mobile devices, AirDroid Parental Control is a great solution. With this tool, you can manage which sites your child can access, view browsing history, and receive alerts if they try to visit a blocked site. Let me show you how. First, ensure you've installed AirDroid Parental Control and linked it with AirDroid Kids on your child's phone. Open AirDroid Parental Control and tap Website Restrictions. Switch to Blacklist Mode. Then tap URL Blacklist. Here, you can manually add URLs you want to block or select from the browsing history. You can also block by choosing Categories in Subscription. Once set up, your child will no longer have access to these sites and you'll receive alerts if they try to open them. That's all we want to talk about. For your convenience, we have left the download link of AirDroid Parental Control in the description below. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials. See you in the next video.